I read the book Crushing It by Gary Vee and it literally changed my life. And when I say changed my life, I mean, it made me millions and millions and millions of dollars. I know you probably thought I was gonna wait a while to tell you the name of the book. No, you can honestly stop watching the video right here. It was Crushing It by Gary Vee, but if you're not gonna read the book, at least let me explain it to you in just a couple words. I know that it only takes 30 seconds to get somebody's attention on YouTube. I just want to say I love you as a brother, as a sister, and I love you as somebody that I believe will succeed in each and everything they do. Just work, put your head down, and you will see it. I read the book Crushing It by Gary Vee, and essentially in October of 2020, I was 18 years old, I was a broke college student as many of us are, but I like to believe that we are just broke in the moment. Being broke is not forever. But I was, um, I was, I won a whole week not eating. I was losing a ton of weight. I had no friends. I had no money because my bank account was negative. And I've always been a side hustle person. I have done everything you can think of from wholesaling real estate, from reselling shoes to reselling jewelry, starting a social media marketing agency to drop shipping. Oh, and reselling Popeye's chicken sandwiches. In all of that, none of them really found me long lasting success until my my bank account went negative in October of 2020. And I realized that if God really wants you to move, he's gonna force the move to happen for you. I remember I said, well, God, all my life I've chased the money and allow me now to just chase the knowledge. And that's when everything changed. And I asked my mom to book me a flight home. I got on the first flight home. You know, when I showed up at home, the first thing I did is I went to the library and I went to pick up this book called Crushing It by Gary Vee. And it was like how successful entrepreneurs thrive in business or something like that. So I started reading it thinking like he's gonna give away all these genius marketing tips and he's gonna tell me everything that I need to know. Yeah, no, that wasn't it. Basically all the book talked about was that when you are a genuine person and you help people, because you want to help people, not because you want to seek a reward or reap something, success always follows. It was insane to me because he started telling all these stories of these people who just wanted to help people, they just wanted to be good people. The success was insane. They started, they like grew to these multi-million dollar businesses. And so in that time where I was reading this book, I also started learning something called the stock market. You know, you probably heard of it. It was options trading in the stock market. So it was a form of trading. I was studying it like crazy. I was super into it. Like I'm telling you, I had my head locked down. I was locked in my room, stuck to my life laptop watching every YouTube video you could think of. Entered my first trade with $26 because I had $50 in my Robinhood and no money in my bank account. So I said, I'm just gonna try the Robinhood money. I turned $26 into 400 literally overnight. To say the least, it was absolutely insane. And when I found the success, I documented it because I was like, hey, I just turned $26 into 400 and I didn't do anything to sleep. And so I started to document it on my Instagram. Then that week I turned $26 to 1,000 and I turned $26 to 3,000 and I said, oh my God, Gosh, everyone needs to know about this. I've always been the person who wanted people to like, ooh, what does she do? And like be mysterious. But I learned that, that doesn't help you in any way in life. Wanting to be the center of attention, wanting to feel like, you know, you're your main character. No, be the person that's the bridge between someone else's struggle and their success. You're the answer. I made a video about it because I said, hey, there's a lot of people who struggle financially in this world. Way too many people. That's why the middle class is the largest class. I was just like, I need everyone to know about this. So I made a TikTok video and it just happened to go viral. It is always just stuck in me. Like now nothing I do is financially motivated. Nothing I do is, oh, I, I wanna do this so I can make this amount of money. I've taken away the expectations of how much money should be made. I've taken away the expectation of, taken away the expectation of expecting somebody to feel or do a certain thing because of what I do. I do it because it's in my heart. In doing that, I found so much success. I've made millions and millions of dollars. Money that I didn't even think I would ever really touch. And it, it's just been absolutely insane to me. So I'm just so blessed and I'm honored and I'm grateful. And I wanted to just share that with you because you don't even have to read the book to know that being a good person reaps good rewards. The Bible itself says what you sow, you reap. So it's spiritual and it's biblical. So if you want to be a good person, don't expect somebody to be good only because you're good, but be a good person. And yes, you're going to face some struggle. Some people may abandon you. Some people may take advantage of you. But as long as you are good and you don't have the expectation that somebody won't take advantage of you, you will be okay. I hope that added value to you your life today if, if that's the only thing I could do. Oh, so I end every single one of my videos with a prayer. If you haven't met me yet, I'm going to pray for you if you're okay with that. Uh, just let me speak these positive words of affirmation over you, these positive words of success. God, I ask that you bless and protect each and every single person watching this. I ask that you allow their hearts and their minds to be calm, that they will be at peace, that nothing will distract them, nothing will bother them. God, for there's somebody right now that is watching this video and I'm seeing them on a horse. For some reason, there's a horse involved 
involved and the horse is running, but it's stuck in the same place. God, as they are stuck in the same position, God, I ask that you start moving that horse, that anything that they have, oh Lord, that it starts moving, anything that they feel like they is stuck, that it starts moving, God. For we know that you are a God that can solve many things, for you can do the impossible, for you made me a millionaire in one year. And Lord, I know that you can make somebody else a millionaire faster. And even if you don't make them a millionaire faster, even if you don't make them one at all, that you can allow them to see success in other areas of their life that they feel they're lacking in. So I ask that you allow them to move, that you allow them to be successful in every area, that you allow them to see blessings in every area of their life. God, I ask that you really work in their life and every single thing that you do in Jesus name. Amen. A lot of people probably ask me, Kelly, why do you pray in your videos? Some people say I do it so that, you know, other people will be like, oh, she loves God. But really, genuinely, God told me that the one thing I should make sure I never do in this life is leave him and I would never leave him and he will never leave me nor forsake me for he said that himself nor you. So yeah, I hope you have a blessed day. I hope you stay blessed. I hope you're amazing and um, God bless you in everything you do. Mwah. <laughs>